But we begin tonight with a frightening drive by two teenagers shot near Henry Ford High School in the city of Detroit. Good evening and welcome to 7 Action News at 11. I'm Carolyn Clifford. The shooting happened just as school was getting out. Police say at least three young men wearing masks circled the area before they opened fire. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass takes us through what happened and who police are looking for right now. Brett. Well, multiple shots were fired here outside Henry Ford High School, shattering the back glass of a vehicle. As you can see, police have a lot of evidence to search through as they continue looking for the suspects. We heard gunshots. We dropped low, went to the window, heard the tires um, and a white van taking off. It was shortly after dismissal at Detroit's Henry Ford High School when a car pulled up on two students and fired shots. Tiffany Butler lives directly across the street and saw the aftermath. Some students running around. Um, I let one young man in so he could call his parents. He was shaking up really bad because it happened right in front of him. Police believe the two teens shot are students at Henry Ford. The grandmother of one of the victims was on the street parked in her car as the shooting happened. Uh, they were both walking to vehicles being picked up uh, by relatives, parents, what have you, and that's when they were both shot. Chief James White says both teens were seriously hurt and taken to the hospital. Police say the suspects were seen wearing masks and circling the area before the shooting. Police are now investigating what led to the attack. But we have our gang intel on the ground as well, and uh, we're pulling that information together. A few blocks away, DPD officers racing to the scene got in an accident with another car flipped upside down. The officers and those inside the car are expected to be okay. I hear they're okay. Um, I've been getting that information. Obviously, they were rushing over here because this came out as a school shooting, uh, but we got to be careful. As police comb through evidence and surveillance video, they say they have an idea who the suspects may be, but continue to investigate, vowing to make an arrest very soon. We're going to relentlessly work this case, uh, working with them, and we're going to be uh, hopefully making an arrest pretty soon. No one else is at risk. Uh, no one at the school is at risk, uh, and we know who we're looking for. Now, as the investigation continues, if you know anything or saw anything outside of Henry Ford High School today, contact Crime Stoppers. That number is 1-800-SPEAK-UP. On the northwest side of Detroit, I'm Brett Cast, 7 Action News.